It was an odd year. This is Yael Shelbia. The New York Post decided that she is the most beautiful woman in the world. Everybody freaked out about it. Some of the reactions. Honestly the part that gives me pain is they decided to make a 19-year-old quote the most beautiful woman in the world unquote. Like, girl, that's barely a woman, that's still a girl. Naming a 19-year-old woman the most beautiful in the world should be considered an act of violence. Like who decided that this 19-year-old girl is the most beautiful woman in the world? She's barely a woman. Trashing her appearance is so gross. Not to mention the adult men on here sexualizing a 19-year-old. I'm sorry but the most beautiful woman in the world being a 19-year-old is predatory. But yeah, a 19-year-old who can't even go into a bar is the most beautiful woman in the world. None of y'all find it creepy that a 19-year-old is deemed the most beautiful woman in the world? I think it's very fucking weird that a 19-year-old got deemed the most beautiful woman in the world. Like, that's a child. There's a lot wrong with this. But something about calling a 19-year-old the most beautiful woman doesn't sit right with me. Like, yeah, she's legal, but that's a child. Literally what the fresh hell is wrong with y'all? First of all I promise you, only in a predator's world is the most beautiful woman in the world a 19-year-old girl. Wow. A huge meltdown over a 19-year-old model. As if we haven't had 14 and 16-year-old models for years. What the fuck? The internet was really upset that Yael was called a woman, when she's obviously not. This is a child. He's 10 years old. What would be worse? Drafting him into the army and making him fight in a war? Or letting him win a beauty contest against his peers? Is this a child? What would be worse? Drafting her into the army and making her fight in a war? Or letting her win a beauty contest against her peers? In fact Yael was drafted into the army as almost all 18-year-old Israelis are, and she is currently a soldier in the Arab-Israeli conflict. The internet had no problem with society forcing Yael Shelbia into the Israeli army. She's a child. Yael was old enough to be a soldier, but not old enough to be considered a woman. So she's a child soldier. Why no outrage about Yael the 19-year-old child being forced to fight wars? Furious that someone might find a 19-year-old beautiful or sexy, the internet lashed out. Like, come on. No one her age has ever won a beauty contest before. What fresh hell is this? Who could ever think 19-year-olds are sexually attractive? So weird. Current sex-phobic neo-Puritan dogma agrees that teens can have sex with each other. There's nothing wrong with that. Or? Here's a story. There were two teenagers Francis and Tony. Like other humans they wanted to have sex. They did. Being from fundamentalist families they had zero sex education, didn't use protection, and Francis got pregnant. Their strict religion forbade abortion, so they got married. This story does not have a happy end. Decades later Tony is a dirtbag politician, and he runs for Congress. So his opponents dig up the old story of his teenage romance and call him a rapist. What Bouchard did was to rape a child. Bouchard had a relationship with, Reed, raped, a 14-year-old girl when he was 18. It's horrifying how rape is just dismissively discussed or language is softened to describe brutal assault. Anthony Bouchard needs to be on the docket, not in any position of power. You're not a Romeo for getting a 14-year-old pregnant at 18. So, Anthony Bouchard says that when he got a 14-year-old child pregnant when he was a young adult of 18, 
it was a Romeo and Juliet thing. Republican Anthony Bouchard got 14-year-old teen girl pregnant when he was a grown man 18-year-old. Bouchard is a predator. No mention of the fact that he got a 14-year-old child pregnant when he was a young adult. Remember how this 19-year-old is a child. But apparently, despite being younger than this child, 18-year-old Tony was an adult. Everybody loves the word rape now. So let's be clear, these people claim it was rape based only on the fact that he was an adult and she was four years younger. But we just learned that 18-year-olds are children. How can he be an adult? Yael is an adult, and a soldier in the Israeli army. But she is also a 19-year-old child. Anthony Bouchard was a child according to the internet, until he has sex with another teenager, when he instantly becomes an adult, and a child rapist. The hypocrisy is appalling. We have to stop lying to ourselves about these things. Nature turns children into adults through a process called puberty. Teenagers are young adults. It's basic biology. Let's face the fact that really dumb sex-phobic neo-Puritan dogma is forcing us to deny science. Let's stop the hysteria. Let's respect young adults.